Ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to Let's Play Under Rail with no fair fight. Risk it, you said, Will. That means we're going right into the lair of the evil itself, into the stalker lair, and that are humans that live underground, stalking around in stealth mode and trying to kill you wherever they can. But there is a place there that is protected by poison. And there should be reasonable fair loot there. And in order to get that, we'll do whatever it takes. Means crawling around in the... So, this is protected. Let's get our guns ready, because you can bet something that we're getting engaged. We might be able to kill one, or maybe even two of the stalkers if we run into them, but only if we use grenades. Because that's the only weapon we have that can actually deal enough damage to kill one of these suckers. Um, we must be extremely careful though. Okay, there's nothing there. That's good to know. The cameras are watching us. That's good because the cameras belong to our guys. So we do not treat them as that. Oh, look at that. We just covered the door and extra experience items. Isn't that beautiful? I think it is. Anything in else here? Explosives. We don't care for explosives. We don't want to blow ourselves up if we can stop it. So... It must be close and there it is. Beautiful. So, let's equip our gas mask. That gas mask will not protect us entirely. Let's make that clear. Okay, no damage done. Are we okay? Did we get any? It looks like we got everything. Okay. What did we get in the end? We got a gun. A hawker that we can immediately load with the two bullets we have. Um, and that's basically it. Okay, is there anything more we can do? I don't think so. We could try to go into the ventilation shafts, but I don't think that that is a good choice. we go any deeper we might be attacked let's not forget this is enemy territory like really enemy territory there is a barrel however with some extra scrap and some more with a molotov cocktail which is nice we'll take that every time of the day okay I think we're out you should not be greedy they say and we're not We've got a gun, we've got some extra loot due to the secrets that we found, so I think we cannot complain. Yes, we could try to kill one or two of the stalkers if we play our cards right, but there is also the chance that they kill us. And um, yeah, no, sorting, no loading, no saving, that would be a very bad choice. The gas mask, however, did. We could now even theoretically sell it, although it is in pretty bad shape. So I don't think we get a lot of money out of it. Um, we've got the Hexter. We've got that. That is beautiful. Is there anywhere else? There is one place we can theoretically go. But it's extremely dangerous as well. And I'm not that nuts. I mean, I'm, I'm surely not totally mental healthy. At this point, running around in under rail with a guy that has no evasion and no dodge. But yeah, there are limits even to that. So next point we go, or next place we go, is the Red Hound area. We need more experience to level up and more um, cave tunnels exited docks. Good choice. And more ammunition, because we're pretty low on ammunition with our second gun. And as I mentioned, this the hammer is not a weapon for fighting itself. It's a weapon to get you an enormous amount of uh, damage out of your special ability, the aimed shot. 
this one here. Because that is an ability that works the better or the higher your skills, uh, your weapon damage is. And that can fire more often. Or is not wasting points, you have 50 action points. I can fire the weapon here once. I could fire another weapon that do 10 to 15 damage that costs 10 action points 5 times. So I would do more damage with that. That is old Jonas. He's telling us about this place. And he's selling stuff. He's selling a 5 millimeter pistol he's selling some traps I totally like traps to be honest and he's also selling a hopper leather armor a lifting belt which is nice a trapper's belt which is extra nice um, how much for those oh uh, yeah I don't have the coin okay I get it but you've got um, an extra mission if I'm not wrong yes That was the mission to find um, his watch. If you find his watch, you get... Um, if you have the persuasion height in high enough, you will get a gun, boots, and hypersprays. If you've just got uh, none of, not enough perception, um, persuasion, you will just get one of the items. We, of course, want all of the items. Don't tell me I just wasted a shot. I think I did. Oh boy. And I've got so little of those. I'm an idiot. No! Bring that bullet back! Well, I know I can't. Such is life. Okay. There's some rat hounds in there. We know that. So, but I think the Red Hound deserves a special episode. Last episode was the Stalker Adventure. Next episode will be the Red Hounds. See you all there. Bye.